me, Mutus. That guy, you love me. Uh, as you can see, we have a new format going right now. We got some better technology to work with, so we can make a little better production value with no extra cost to you, the viewer. So, uh, this week, this episode, this month, whatever, been kind of slow lately. You know that. And, uh, this time around, we're going to show you some interesting products, you know, labels, shit like that. Uh, section, the Chinese. Come on. They, they rip off everything. They make cheap rip off iPods. They make rip off PS3s. They make, they rip off toilet paper. I mean, come on. Just Google it. If you don't believe me, just look. These are some examples right here. Okay, so I thought we'd start off here with some nice signage. This first one's the wrong noodle bar, so I guess that's good to know. That way you don't walk in and eat there. I mean, God forbid you eat at the wrong noodle bar over the right one. <laughs> this is... This one speaks for itself. Chick cock? <laughs> is... Is transvestites, maybe? Uh... I don't know. Anyway. On to the next one, please. Ah, yes. I heart cock. Hmm. Tasty. I bet you'd like a nice hot glass of I heart cock, wouldn't you? A nice hot glass of I heart cock. That needs better than that. Anyway, now we're going to move on to some more Chinese stuff. Uh, these are more labeled than anything, but they're still pretty good. Let's see what we got. First off, we have the crack sandwich in peanut flavor. Just for that crackhead on the go who needs that burst of energy. Mmm, crack sandwich. Next, we have the dick stick. I'm not even sure if I want to know what this product's supposed to be for. Okay. Okay, this one's too good. We used enough milk it, you will be satisfied with the plentiful milk taste. Satisfied? Uh, okay. Unbelievable! This is not butter. Really? You think it might have been a tip off? Pain apple candy. I don't need to say anything else. Okay, I want you to be able to make sure you can read this one here. Fresh sandwich. This sandwich is fresh, homemade, and delicious. We want you to try, try to eat this sandwich. Just try. I dare you. Okay, this next one. Oh my goodness. Backyard basketball. First off, the kid's face. I can't tell if he's pissed or if he looks like he's going to take a crap. What? Okay, above that you'll see convulsing enter. Okay. The little rip-off EA logo down at the bottom didn't help matters either. But the best part is proceed a vigorous game right at the top. The fuck? Vigorous game. Okay, enough with the Chinese stuff. I mean, I don't want people to think I've got an issue with Chinese people. I don't, personally. Y'all know that. But just a few other things. And to prove that, I'm going to show you pictures from Walmart. Yeah, 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 yeah. Back on the Chinese. But... <laughs> Seriously, these are some interesting, you'll see, just wait, American ingenuity at its finest. Okay, so to start our little two-part Walmart picture, first off, for mom with love, Trojan condoms! What better way to say I love you, mom, than here, don't have any more kids. Ah, okay, and of course, the best of all, was 118, now roll back to 250, saving you money, always. Okay, uh, this next segment, there are no longer any more Walmart pictures, as far as I know. Uh, but uh, some more, I think, American products. I'm not sure. These might be photoshopped. I can't really tell for sure. They look like they're legit, but, you know. So, here you are. Have a look. Shit be gone toilet paper. Because you need a toilet paper that makes shit be gone. Ask your doctor if my cock is right for you. Might be. Might not. See, this is what's wrong with the country. Nobody realizes that baby needs beers and wines. They need them. Okay, so 
Admittedly, this episode isn't the best I've made. It is a little ill-prepared, but... Hey, you didn't think you'd get away all episode without seeing one cigarette, did you? For you, Scott, no apology necessary. Anyway, so, before I go, I just want to give a shout-out to the people who watch the show. You know who you are. I don't necessarily. The one fan I do have, though, my personal favorite YouTuber in the world, Mr. Power Power. Let's give a shout out to him right now. Yo! <laughs> Love you, Mark. <laughs>